Right now it is two o'clock. Little Jada is gonna be walking in the door any minute. Cause it's time for her to get out of school. So I am determined that today's vlog is not gonna turn into a two-day vlog. Not gonna happen. So right now, oh y'all. Y'all know, get waves like this, get waves like this. You must brush, you must. It is the secret. Don't say stuff ain't tell you, but it's the secret. So, even though I just got a fresh haircut last Thursday, <laughs> I want to be like a shopping knife. Shop. On Saturday, I want to be shopped this whole weekend, y'all. I'm going to the city that loves me, and that is the NYC. And y'all, let me just tell you this I have been like, took all y'all ideas into consideration. You know, I was gonna do something when it comes to our anniversary this weekend. However, this is what I came to the conclusion. I ain't planning nothing. Nope. Sometimes the things that are unplanned, first off, you can't get disappointed when shit don't go the way you want it to go. Second, adventure. So I am just really not even planning nothing. I just really want to take this weekend with my husband because I will have him all to myself. Woo! I just want to take this weekend to just enjoy uh, each other to the fullest. And sometimes when you have been married for so long, sometimes you just need to wing it, okay? It's in the uh, How to Stay Married for Dummies book 101. Uh, sometimes you just need to wing it. Everything cannot be planned. Everything ain't going to go the way you think it's going to go. So sometimes the best thing to do is wing it. So I was going to look up uh, restaurants. I was going to look up clubs. I was gonna look up all that so if y'all want to know what i'm using i'm using one heck of a blot yeah i don't know it's just it want to focus on me not this okay but i'm using this as my primer i wanted to try something different because y'all know my number one primer y'all was asking me in I think the vlog where I was talking about uh, perfection is an illusion. Y'all asking me what what uh, primer I was talking about at Walgreens. This primer right here is the ish, okay? I went to Walgreens that day to pick up another one of these and they was sold out. So I ended up going with this. And so far, I like it. It's 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 Gucci. I'm just gonna try to squeeze Ooh, all the remnants out of this because I think I'll stop at the Walgreens by my job. I'm gonna get off and um I'll see if they have it. But you know you gotta go where they sell you know all the ethnic lines too. You know because depending on what area you you go to, you're not gonna find Milani. I love them. So, like I was saying, why this is setting? I am. 
supposed to be at work at 5. It's 2 p.m. I'm going to be at the barbershop at 3.30 because I need to get a haircut. I just want to be short. Okay? So, I'm going to talk to y'all. Probably not the whole time I get dressed because y'all know. Y'all could be a distraction. Yeah, it's like... Um, I make it a point to never, ever, ever be on the phone when I'm doing my makeup because it seems like it takes me forever. Why? Because I'm somebody who talk with their hands and facial expressions. You know what I'm saying? So, sugar. Hold on. I am um, about to try to get dressed and talk to y'all in between time i might have to like stop come back stop come back so pretty much it's gonna be like a little get ready with me uh daily vlog today hey Woo! which means that it is fair ground to talk about whatever so y'all already know first things first I was just talking about our weekend, which I'm very, very excited about. <sighs> sometimes, do y'all like just get so revved up that like you can't even like calm the hell down sometimes? <sighs> y'all, I will be right back, okay? I need to just like woosah. Maybe I need to holler because I just have like woo something just in me, y'all. Just I just whew, that's all I can say. Whew. Can't even focus on trying to get dressed. Good thing I ain't doing no damn story time because honey, I wouldn't even be able to focus. I'm doing a damn story time, okay? So, what I'm about to do, y'all, I went to Ulta yesterday, and I purchased me a new pencil. Tomorrow, when I get off work, and I have to take Jada to her appointment, I need to go by the mall, and I need to get my brows threaded, because, y'all, they need to be done, like, for real. Like, y'all don't see them straight hairs. So, I don't want to clean them up or cut them or anything like that because then I'll be done cut too much. And she won't have nothing to thread. You feel me? So, yesterday I went to Ulta because I ran out of my ColourPop pencil. And y'all know I'm a ride or die one for this right here. Maybelline Defina Lash. But since they have like repackaged, y'all... They be jipping us. This ish right here be $7.99, $8.99. And when I tell y'all, I think the pencil, oh, I can see it right through. The pencil literally is very, very short, okay? So literally, like, you be going through it faster than you think. And not for $8, okay? Shoot, when with ColourPop, I can have that pencil for damn near, I know, two times the length that I be having that one. So, I stopped at Ulta yesterday because I really needed a pencil. Because y'all know they don't sell ColourPop in the store. They need to, but they not. So, I am trying out for the first time NYX's, uh, what is this? Micro Brow Pencil. I'm trying this out for the first time. And the color, about two, because I didn't know which color I was going to need, because y'all know I'm a blonde. The one I'm working with right now is called Ash Brown. So I picked this one up because y'all know I'm blonde and I don't be wanting it to look like too harsh. So I'm just doing my brows right now. As you can see, I outline it first and then I go back and I fill. I fill in all the empty space. So, y'all, last night I had to get a little creative. Can't look behind me. Y'all see my sunglasses? Okay, I updated the, the vertical row. I updated it, okay? 
and then I'm gonna show y'all a clip of what I was going through last night so watch this I have a real problem when it comes to sunglasses this is the box to give away keep and then I just updated I had to get creative with another way to uh, display them versus going straight down vertically so I can see them all I know this is sad like really like how many big eyed helpers need all these sunglasses like you know to block the shade now do it make sense to any one person one one person to have that many glasses probably not however I'm going to let Jada uh, go through the box that you know ones that I said that you know I'm done with and I'm gonna let Jada pick out any ones that she wants and then I know her little her friend at school she loves sunglasses too so I'm gonna let her uh, take some to her friend too because you know she had a wealth you know what I'm saying so I had to concoct a new way to hang them because I got too many and I can often sometimes forget how many I have or what I have so I took some pants hangers and I hung them up as y'all can see let me let y'all get closer I hung them up as such okay now I had to do this because uh it's too many and y'all I still have this package from just J walks or J just walks yeah J don't don't come for me girl okay cuz I'll be messing up the name I'm sorry but I'll be sure to put the link below so you guys can check her glasses out but she is the one plus y'all that have inspired me to do a what do you call it a sunglass lookbook so I'm gonna be doing one not today not tomorrow it'll probably be sometime next week and next week I just really want to do like a lot of visually stimulating things so I really want to like take y'all through the mindset of when I'm getting dressed sometimes like right now I'm doing because literally y'all uh, uh, if I'm not doing the story time I try not to talk while I'm doing my makeup because it just take too damn long, okay? And right now, time ain't on my side. No, it ain't. It ain't, okay? So, speaking of time, I thought Jada was going to be home right now, but she's not. She did tell me this morning that she's staying at the school to finish or redo a biology test. So, I'm going to finish these eyebrows and I'm going to be back. And we'll continue talking for the next phase, okay? Mm-hmm. Y'all, didn't I just tell y'all Jane ain't supposed to be home at 3 o'clock because she was staying no, for a biology test? Say, no. And here she go. The security guard said everyone get on the bus. Nobody can stay after today. Walk over here. And she gonna tell me. What'd you say? I'm hot. Why you ain't talking about the weather? It's 97 degrees outside. You sound like you need to get up in the morning, go turn the TV on, and see what the weather is going to be like. Who watches the weather channel? Everybody! I was joking. <laughs> oh! But you have the device that makes the job a lot easier. You can tell me the night before. Uh, you were asleep when I came home. You could have been woke me up. No, 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 no. You wasn't asleep. You went to bed. You didn't ask. It was my bedtime. What did you expect? Yeah, but Plus, you... I had park testing this week. I have to go to bed early. Yeah, that's what they call Jersey uh, end of the school year testing. The paw test. Like paw? Paw? Par. You said par. It's park. Like, oh, I thought it was par. I don't know. It's park. My bad. Uh, Thanks for the boots, though. <sighs> I tried them on. They seemed a little big. Like, oh, well, that's good. Because you'll have them for winter, too, next this year. When I walked in them... Um, it's like my heel wasn't at the back of the boot. It was like a gap between my heel, but my foot was at the front of the um shoe. Oh, great. 
She talking about a pair of boots that I bought her for Christmas, y'all. I just gave them to her last night I just because saw her bag just sitting there in the dark. Like, what is that? Yeah, I just gave them to her because um I was tired of holding them hostage where I had them hostage at. Well, I'm gonna take a shower. Uh, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. She talking about what the heck is that? That is my new storage. Hanger, what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna make it, I'm gonna make it a little bit more appealing though. I think I'm gonna use a string versus the hangers. I don't know. I might. Let, I gave you that idea. Why don't you do that again? Because yeah. I don't want to put all those holes in that door. Thumbtacks. Thumbtacks. Where do we have thumbtacks? Try to see if we have some in the um, kitchen drawer because if the thumbtacks can go in the door, then that will work. But y'all, everything in our house is brick or concrete. You cannot use a regular wall nail to hammer in these walls, okay? All your new glasses? That's, that's, that's updated. Old. Those are updated. Oh, and I got some glasses that you and Shanti can go through and see which ones y'all like. Oh, you got more? I know, right? Dog! Y'all must just love her! Oh, these are old ones. Yeah. Well, well not these. when she comes over for my birthday, she can pick out any she likes. She really likes the ones that you gave me to get her. Um, what the heck are these? What, what? Oh, those from y'all when I had, um, mm. I was Trinity from The Matrix. <laughs> You might want to keep those because I don't think I want those or Shanti. Or give them to daddy. Daddy, uh-uh. Because I can't stand them uh, B-looking glasses he be wearing. I like him at aviators. Mm, I don't know. Try them on see. But remember I had told y'all I couldn't read Jada's uh, Mother's Day card because the print was blocking the words. That it came out her mouth. So, Jada, would you mind reading it? I didn't expect you to come home and start crying. I expected to come home and take a shower. Well, let, 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 let's cry together before I put this eye makeup on. So, the card says, I think you're amazing, Mom. The way you stay strong through all life's ups and downs. How family is so important to you no matter how busy you are. How when you care about someone, you care all your heart, and how you've always believed in me and loved me for who I am. So many things make you amazing, Mom, and I love you and admire you for each and every one. Happy Mother's Day with love. This year, 2017, I've put you through a lot of things that I never would have thought I would. All this time, you have been my real and only writer. I have been over here calling fake people my best friend. When all along my best friend gave birth to me 15 years ago on June 6, 2001. You're the only best friend I need and will ever need. The older I get, the more I start to understand life much better. I'm starting to understand you're always going to be right because you want to see me make it. I have never given you the proper apology. Mother, mommy, and best friend, I am truly sorry for everything I have done to make you feel like I don't care because I truly do. I'm trying to I'm trying to change and make you proud. I hate to see you hurt and I hate to see the hurt in your eyes. I truly am sorry, mommy, from the deepest part of my heart. <sighs> so touching. I love you, Jada. I love you too. I know you do. Why are your eyebrows red? Cause it was a um, it was a lip liner you had gave me, and it was brown. Well, I guess when it's mixed with my skin color, I guess it's not brown. Yeah. It'll work though when I get my hair red. <coughs> so now y'all can see why I was so emotional. Jasmine said I beat her card this year on Sunday. It wasn't about who was going to beat each other's card. It wasn't about that. I'm it not was just saying that. It was just that I could tell that you really sat down and really put some thought into that. She's not going to want her to leave me alone so I could write my card. She was focused. Because they wanted me to go make... make Ain't no day. 
She, Jasmine wanted me to go put hot dogs in this, in the stove. Then she wanted me to give her a towel. Then she wanted me to go get her some toilet paper. And I told her, I'm doing something. I will do it when I'm finished. And then I never did it because I was really in the zone of writing my card. So she did it when she got out of the shower. Yeah, me and her shared a hot dog together. And James and Jada had Chipotle that day, okay? Anywho. Oh, I didn't show y'all my new piece that she got me for Mother's Day. Oh my gosh. It's a high heel. I see it. No, because it wants to focus on something else. But y'all get the gist. Right. Yeah. So, so emotional. I'm trying not to cry right now because I don't want to be emotional right now. I just don't. And then I told Daddy. I told Daddy, I was like, oh yeah, me and Mommy came here a few months ago. You know, we looked at what I wanted for my birthday. He was like, what exactly is that? I said, I want a princess crown ring. And then the lady brought it out. He was like, that's what you want? I was like, yes, Daddy. That's so what I want. Special. However, what I was going to say? What I was going to say? Oh, I was going to say something. What? I was going to say... I want that ring, but then I would like a promise ring from Daddy. Mm. What What is actually is a promise ring from your daddy? Like, what, what does that mean? Tell me what that signifies. What are you promising? To keep making him proud, even though for the past freshman year, I haven't. And Girl, you got in trouble the other night, I heard. I ain't gonna even lie. I was cracking up. <laughs> I was cracking up. I was. I was trying to be quiet so much. I was all in the pool. <laughs> it, it is funny. You cannot tell me. That's not something I would have did. There's something grandma does. <laughs> I mean, grandma made Kayla eat it was a salad. My my little, my little niece, she had pizza one day and my mama had said, uh, you you better eat that salad too. So what she did, she she dropped it on the she ground. She dropped it. She made salad. it seem like it was an accident. So she wouldn't have to eat it and grandma would let her throw it away. But nope. My crazy grandmother <laughs> made her eat it with the hair. And the dust off the floor. Her floor wasn't swept. <laughs> Felt so bad for Kayla that day. I had to leave the room. <laughs> she learned that day. If May Rose put something on your plate, you better eat it. I mean, Grandma do be overpacking people's plates now. Because that's just how she is. Mama got a stomach. Her eyes bigger than her stomach. That's, that's what it where is. I came from. But y'all, I told y'all already what happened with Jada and James the other night. Y'all, I was in the bed because he said that you <laughs> just went to sleep when I came out. And I was like, he was in the bed telling me about it. And I was like trying not to laugh because he said stuff. I think she could hear you. <laughs> so I was just laughing. And I feel, I said, James, that's something Stephanie would do. He said, you're right. He said, but he warned you. And he said he had to follow through. Y'all, shit was so funny. Jay, it, ain't, it ain't funny now, though. It was funny now. It wasn't funny at the moment, right? It was two days ago. It's not funny. <laughs> <laughs> it's not funny now. It was two days ago. It's been like two weeks, but no. I bet y'all her ass will be eating in that sunroom no more. Because next time. <laughs> Whoa, what happened? 
it started back up. Oh, but it's not with me. Hallelujah. Praise him. I'm going to say a hallelujah because two times. It was, it was like a, the, my the really first close initial. friend got, she, she they, still go to school with you, right? Yeah. Oh. She got in trouble because they came after her. Uh -huh. So there's this girl. She, my close friend was really close with, and she tried to take my spot in her life, but obviously didn't work. And, well, so. Y'all, we'll be back. Okay, y'all, to just sum up, the girl drama was trying to start back. Principal ain't having it. Some people then got removed from school. Permanently. Permanently. And Jada is on the good foot. Jada was not trying to be involved. Jada says she is has learned her lesson. Um, you can say the rest. Let me put this. Basically, it's over with. Officially now. Because my principal was basically saying he's tired of it. He already got three daughters to deal with at home and their girl drama. So he removed them all from school. So now I can actually not have to look over my shoulder at school worrying about somebody going to, you know, try and hit me. So, yeah, it's over. And I told my uh, principal, I was when he had called me and my friend to, like, talk to him, I was like, I don't want to be involved anymore or at all because when I was involved, it stressed me out, stressed my parents out. Ooh! Just my really close friend out. She would call me crying on the phone. Like, it stressed us all out. Y'all, bullying is real. It's and real. It made my grades go down. And now that it was actually, like, on hold for two months, my grades actually went back up. And I don't want them to go back down because it's the end of the year. So, yeah. I'm just happy it's over. I'm happy it's over, too. I'm happy you was able to keep yourself out of that because remember what we said, sometimes when you have too many girlfriends, too many friends, it's a pain. Just the part where like they put that picture like F the fake ones. First off, do you guys not remember we all used to be friends? Like we all used to be really close friends. All used to be having group calls and stuff like now, now, now we're fake. Okay. Okay, that's fine. So whatever. I'll be a fake now. It's just like funny because we divided. Me and S stayed together, and then those two stayed together. Well, and now they're removed from school together. Well. So. Yeah. Well, I'm glad you uh, learned your lesson and stayed out of it, cause. It had nothing to do with you. And you didn't allow yourself because you could have easily got back involved in it. And you didn't. So that takes a lot of self-control. I wish those girls the best, the ones that did get suspended, because Lord knows. I, I don't think... Well, that's permanently. I think the reason... I think the reason they um suspended D was so they could do this first. Mm -hmm. Because they all came to school today. Okay. Well, I don't want to talk about that no more. That's like depressing. Anywho, you fine. You healthy. You can go to school and not be a part of uh oh shit. You are fresh. You got your getting your grades together. And uh Oh yeah, when I checked the computer today, did you know my chorus grade up went up to a seventy five? You better have it, because honey, I was going to come for her. Sure was. She told me that um, the day we're supposed to be doing at the middle school more likely would be June 10th. No, June 9th. That's on a Friday. Mm. I was just like, okay. We're doing um, um, a, um, a small town girl. You know that song? There you go. Just a small town girl living in a lonely world. She took the midnight train going everywhere. Find it. Just a city boy. I don't know the whole song. This song, the song it's from Rock from... of Ages. Oh, okay. I don't know what song you're talking about. I can't think of the, the, the melody right now. Yeah, we're singing that song and then we're singing some other song. I don't know. Small town girl. Living in a lonely world. 
She took the midnight train going everywhere. The dude sang it. Mm hmm And then just a city boy. I don't know the rest after that. I just know the girl part. I wonder if your daddy back. Back where? He went to the city today because they have a retirement ceremony they're getting ready for. And he said he had to go pick up equipment. I Does he have a car? His government car? Of course. Um, he can ride his bike one Ooh, y'all. See, Jada came home and took over. Okay. Literally. All right. Honey. So, I told y'all, bullying is real. And it's sad, but it is. All right, y'all. This is a basic face. Basic, okay. Basic. Cause depends on who washed my hair. When um I get there, child, please, my hairline, all this might be gone. Okay. Like I said, depends if the girl is there to wash her today. Jada, bring me my earrings out the bathroom. Oh, honey, this is how you uh, eliminate flashback. Once you set your eye concealer, just wipe your, your powder over it and it will eliminate your flashback, okay? Girl drama, glad my girl is learning. She understanding now that uh, you are gonna go through some friends, you are gonna go through some people um, while you in school. You know what I'm saying? Why are you just a simple face today? Cause I'm gonna go to the barber shop. You know, I'm, I'm are you about to make my appointment too? I'm going to make it with, what's her name, Nani, yeah. What if she don't got a date around my birthday? I hope she do. That's three weeks out. Oh, I hope she do. Wait, wait. Hey, Jess. Hey, mommy. Hi, right, y'all. This is the complete look. I have on a denim head-to-toe jumper designed by Mama. I to say thumb, please. And um, I'm waiting for this vlog to go before I leave the house. I'm about to go take my outfit of the day picture. And then I'm going to pull my baby daddy. We're on my way to work. We're on my way to the Volvo. So, yeah. Y'all can sit here and watch me take this picture. Hold up. Okay, hold on. 16 and how many beats is it? Three? Three. And three today. Weeks. I got to go. I'm coming. Really? Who are you talking to, little girl? I said I'm coming. Girl, don't get don't get knocked out. I'm the closing heat. all your apps so I can save your battery. Tomorrow at 315 500 Park Avenue. Oh, that's where, that's where your thing is? No, that's where your appointment is. Uh, it says Stephanie's therapist appointment, not me. Oh, mine got canceled. I canceled it. My appointment? Where did I have your, Yours is tomorrow. That's fine. At, oh, 315. Oh, my God. Okay. So I won't be able to stay after now? No. Well, you can, but you got to be home at 3 because I got to... I'm normally going to say after I am home at 3. Okay, come down this way. Okay. Oh, she 
for lunch. I hope she has an appointment available. <sighs> okay, y'all. So this is going to conclude today's get ready with <laughs> Steph and Jada. Because it looked like Jada took over, right? You I'm did. Just, like, crying in my head right now. Girl. Available Hi. For June. Please. Please. Please what? Pay attention to what the weather is going to be tomorrow because sweatshirts is not the business right now. Don't be ass backwards wearing stuff been and it's hot. Why? I've been wearing a sweatshirt all week. I just wore one today because I thought it was going to be cold in the morning. Don't let Tay Tay come out because Tay Tay will come out. I'm wearing shorts tomorrow. So, y'all, I'll see y'all tomorrow. Same time, same place. And um, we'll talk later.